hey what's up guys by the way i'm dan and welcome to monkey place so guys in today's video we're going to learn a game but before anything else if you're new here in my channel please hit the subscribe button and also click that notification bell so that you can be notified in our next video or to the videos that we're going to upload in this channel like this one and you can watch some of our previous videos that is uploaded on this channel so in today's video we're going to learn a game of a two to nine player game published by Promworks and it's called Nine Lives. So if you really like some cats and you're familiar with the saying that cats have nine lives, you're going to enjoy this game. So let's check out for the setup for this game, the gameplay itself, and um, how to win and be the best cat that is still alive on the game. So guys, if you're ready and I'm ready, so tara, game! So guys, this is the setup for the game Nine Lives. So, for the start of the setup, give each player these 9 chips. So, these 9 chips will be the indication of their lives during the game. In the same time, ito rin yung babantayan natin na uh, mga chips para at least nandun pa tayo sa game. And tayo yung pinaka last cut na merong um, buhay or life. So, these life chips have to, uh, this is a double-sided chip. So, this is a, there's a live cut and a dead cut. So, um, Ito rin yung magi indication natin or marker natin kung ilan na yung live cut natin and kung ilan na yung dead cut. And you can use these live chips dun sa mga mangyayari do sa game. So mamaya pa explain ko sa inyo kung para saan yung chips. And if you can see, there's a different faces of cats here in, in these chips. So um, papakilala ko sila sa inyo. So this is um, Lupin the Thief, Lightning the Cool Cat, Bob the Boring Cat, Chloe the Scurdy Cat. Um, Happy the Unhappy, um, Tiger the Brave, Paquito the Jerk, um, Chubbs the Food Vacuum, and Rocky the Smug. So, if you're playing a 2 to 5 player game, you will give each player 9 chips. And if you're playing a 6 to 9 player game, you will give each player 5 chips. So, let's put these chips on this side. Then, the next thing we need to do is um, shuffle this karma card. So, this karma card will give you a good karma or a bad karma. So, um, there's a possibility that it will give you life or it will decrease your life during the game. So, this card or this karma card or scenario cards will, uh, will uh, somehow magbibigay ka ng mga decision makings. For example, this one, Bella Luna, choose an effect, A, discard as much as you want and draw until you have 5 cards on your hand or B, gain a life or you can use the chips that you have so ito yung mga chips so for example cat burger um, flip a chip um, if it is a live cat the player that goes after you loses life and you gain life or if it's a dead cat you lose a life and the player that goes after you gains a life so after you shuffle this karma card you will put it on the center of the table where everyone can reach it then the next thing we need to do is shuffle this um, poke card. So this poke card consists of three different cards. We have the utility cards, that is the yellow cards. So, ito yung mga cards na magbibigay sa iyo ng mga good effects or something na magpapaganda ng game. Um, you can draw one karma card or and one poke card or shuffle your hand, take a random card, um, gain one life, and so on. And then the other card we have here is the um, Attack card that is the red card. So, this card can be used to other players um, to decrease their lives, or pwede na rin nilang gamitin ito para mabawasan din yung life mo. And if there's an attack card, they also have a defense card. So, for the defense card, um, this card will defend you from any action that will be given sa, during the game. So, uh, we have three main green, green cards here. We have the I will follow, meet shield, and play dead. So I will explain it to you later during the gameplay. And then we shuffle these cards to make sure na hindi magkakasama sama mga red cards, defense cards, and the utility cards. Para at least fair yung distribution. Then after shuffling it, um, deal five cards for each player, and that will be their starting hand for the game. And then the remaining poke card will be put on the center of the table where everyone can see it and reach it. Then the next thing we need to do is give these reference cards. So these reference cards is somehow a guide um, on how to start the game, how to do your turns, 
what is the use of the cards and what is the use of the green bow cards so that's it and that's the setup to to start the game hindi siya katulad ng ibang mga games that kung sino yung pinakabatang player siya yung magsa-start ng game or sino yung pinakamagaling or sino yung pinakamahilig sa pusa but we're going to decide who will be the starting player using these cards so um this is the nine cards na meron ding mga nine character yung nine characters so ito yung mag-indicate kung sino yung starting player so um for example bob the best dance move starts first Rocky, worst temper, Lupin, most coins on his her pocket, Paquito, best evil love, Tiger, the most enthusiastic, Chubbs, the tallest, Happy, um, the least wants to play, Lightning, the most Instagram followers, and Chloe, the youngest player, starts first. So, let's shuffle this, and then let's pick one card, for example, this one, then let's put this remaining cards on this side, and then for this setup, we're going to start the most, um, the player with the most coins on his or her pocket starts first. So, to start the game, first, the, the first player will draw one po, uh, karma card. So, yung effect nito ay kailangan mag-effect during the game na, na, or during the turn of that player. So, for example, this one, ang lumabas sa kanyang karma card is flip a chip. So, um, you lose one life if it is a live cut and you lose two lives if it is a dead cut. So, for example, yan yung karma card. Then, ayoko yung lumabas na karma card. Uh, card. And the same time, meron akong green card na pwedeng pang um, harang sa effect na yan. So, dito na papasok ang green card na I will follow you. So, yung I will follow is a green card that can be used um, sa isang karma card. So, Ito lang yung green card na pwedeng gamitin lang sa karma card. And the effect of this shield is ipapasa mo yung effect ng karma card sa other players. And that's it. So, after natin um, parang i-block yung effect ni karma card, we're going to draw one pole card and let's put it on our hand. And then, let's play one card from our hand. So, for example, this one. So, I play... A red card so lose one life but everyone um, else or everyone else each loses two lives so for example yung ibang player or ayaw nilang mag ma magkaroon ng ganong effect is pwede sila magbaba ng isa pang green card that is the dead cat so si dead cat naman is a defense card that can defend or pwede niya i-block yung action ng isang red card or meron din naman siyang pwedeng maging um, green card na mid shield. So, si mid shield naman ay dinidefend niya or binablock niya yung action ni red card at ni yellow card. So, for example, may nagbaba ng mid shield then I also have a mid shield. So, babalik lang ulit do sa taong nagbaba ng mid shield yung effect ng red card. So, ganun pa rin. So, kung meron ulit siyang mid shield, baba niya ulit and so on, ubusan kami ng mid shield, it's okay. And tapos na yung turn ko. Then, the next player will do the same. Magdadraw siya ng one karma card. It will take effect. So, for example, magpiflip siya ng chip. Dead cut. You lose one life for every um, po card you play on this turn. So, for example, magdadraw ako ng isang po card. Then, pwede ako magbaba ng isang red card. Mababawasan ako ng isang life. And the other player, mababawasan din ng isang life. And matutuloy na ulit yung isa pang game. May ibang player ulit, magdadraw ulit ng isa pang karma card, and so on. And then, may possibility na magkaroon ka ng um, two dead cats, three dead cats, and tuloy-tuloy lang hanggang yung lahat ng player, or ikaw na lang yung natitirang player na may um, remaining alive cats. So, kung ito, ikaw yung pinaka-last player na merong alive cat, or ikaw na lang yung alive player, then you win the game. So, to, to, if you want something that will give twists about this game, you can put some the expansions, the bumper expansions. So, may papalitan lang kayong ibang mga um, poke cards and karma cards on this set. And, gan pa rin yung gameplay. And that's it. That is the game 9 Lives. So, great! So guys, that is 9 Lives by Promworks. So, I really love the gameplay for this game because um, we 
player we play as cats on this game we we try our best to survive in any scenarios that is given by the karma cards or the poke cards and um, we're trying our best to maintain our la nine lives or our life chips na tayo yung pinaka uh, marami ang life chips na natitira or as much as possible yung ibang player yung unang mauubusan ng life chips um, I really love the artwork itself. Um, if you're a fan of a cat or somehow may hilig kayo sa mga cats, you're going to enjoy the, uh, the, the artwork for this, this game. We will see the different characteristics of the, the nine cats. So we can see the characteristics of um, Tiger, um, Chubbs, Chloe, um, Lightning, Paquito, Rocky, um, Blue Pin, happy and one of my favorite is Bob so we can see it in this game and somehow makaka-relate ka makikita pag nakita mo yung isang pusa sa kapitbahay nyo na uy parang si ano yun si Lupin tinangay na naman yung isang galunggong <laughs> so somehow lang matutuwa ka habang iniisip mo yung mga characters and if you're looking for something na twist sa game eh you can add the expansion for this game that is the bumper expansion uh, or uh, one of their um, expansion or print to play expansion that is the coffee rush so uh, I would like to say thank you to Mr. Eves for letting us experience the print to play expansion for for this game uh, for kung sa base game is we're trying our best to stay alive um, kapag kasama ng expansion ng coffee rush um, we're trying our best to get as many coffee as possible because cats uh, naging addicted sila sa coffee. So guys, if you like this kind of video, please give us a like and share this video with your friends and family. And also guys, if you have any comments or suggestions, please leave on the comment section and I really love to read all of your comments or your suggestions. And yeah, don't forget to uh, hit the subscribe button and like button and share this video with your friends and family. So guys, this is the end of this video. See you and it's a wrap.